welcome welcome everyone once again to code slice uh, once again um, we are looking at the bulldozer tutorials all right um, so there's nothing more um, boring you know than having like let's say five Kiwi apps on your mobile phone and they all have the same icon like what in the world <laughs> You know, um, so you might maybe want to customize your icon. You know, you want each app of yours to have its own icon. How do you how do you do that? It's actually quite simple. Yeah. So once again, your bulldozer spec file. That is where everything happens. Oh yeah. Before I open the bulldozer spec file, um, so I have my icon image here. All right. Of course, it's the same as the splash. Um splash uh, screen one yeah but of course for you you will be more creative i know you guys are so creative so you'll create your own special you know pre-splash screen that um, image that covers like the whole screen um, and then you'll have like a different icon or something but for me it's the same thing all right but for you it will be different yeah um okay so we open our um, bulldozer spec file okay all right so in order for us to to um change the icon you need to navigate to here you see here where it says icon of the application all right yeah and it's a string it's a string all right the location yeah so what do we do we uncomment remember uncomment is very important you have to uncomment all right um yeah and for us we sort of already we called it icon png so that's okay you can call it whatever you want but for me i called it icon png um yeah yeah oh uh maybe we have to change this <laughs> uh, expert yeah okay all right yeah so once again this is where you put the icon all right this is where you put the icon so let's go on and do this okay we've saved it yeah so now we have to open open in terminal open in terminal Oh, the terminal is already open here. I have so many t terminals opened. Okay. Um, so we export the path, right, to our local bin path. And then we bulldozer Android debug. Yeah. So now it, it's it's running. Yeah. Um, so maybe something to mention, um, which is... I think this is something that you will encounter, especially if you are serious uh, with building an app on Android. Yeah, so it's very important, like the way you sort of size your your icons and widgets and everything. Um, like, for instance, you might maybe, you know, set a particular size for your icons and your widgets um, in your code. And when you run it on your on your laptop or computer, everything fits like very well. But now when you run it on your Android um, device, you see that everything is, it's not like, uh, the size is not like how you envisioned it would look like. There's like a difference. Yeah. Um, so that usually happens um, if you don't um, use like size hint, uh, for instance, um, yeah, but I will I will um, definitely have like uh, tutorials on that just to 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 help you see what I'm talking about. But for now, I think yeah, you are probably just confused about what I'm talking about. So let me just pause this and we'll continue when it's done compiling. Okay, so the app is done compiling, and as you can see, um, we have the APK in our bin folder so now we're gonna copy it into our mobile phone now before I install the app I just want us to say goodbye to something 
and we are saying goodbye to these weird uncool uh tv icon apps okay <laughs> goodbye to having these many apps with these tv icons because now you can put your own one all right so let's go on and install our very own wow as you can see you can even see the icon there <laughs> all right you can already see the icon there so let's go on and install this Okay, it's installing it's installing whoop it's installed okay it's done now let's go whoa look at that can you see that can you even see that this is a this is like a, a kiwi app can you see it? it looks like any ordinary app right this is like um the power of icons so please do your own icons you know have some nice icons for your app and also have some nice splash screen for your apps as well all right this is it for this tutorial please remember to subscribe i pre i appreciate the support and please let me know in the comments um, um if you there's any questions or any assistance you'd like me to assist you with until next time take care